Good morning. It's Monday. It's public holiday in Australia for most states. Must admit, I'm not quite sure. And daylight saving started on the east coast of Australia. So it's dark. It's very, very dark outside. And our kids are still asleep. Woohoo! <laughs> for once. Not for long because the big old elephant over here will make a lot of noise soon. So, who's got grand final hangovers? Not us here. Sober October. <laughs> Mostly for us. But we're starting our week off the way we intend to. Not too bad, audience, so far. Good to see, good to see. Staying strong, mind and body. It's just another day. It's just another day. We've got lots more gardening to do. As Extreme usual. Gardening. Stream gardening. More holes for Steve to dig. There's always more holes that need to be dug. Apparently. So, it's going to be a good one. I Let's get know. warm. We'll soon find out. Okay, good morning, everybody. Mm -hmm. You old pack of fossils. Okay, Melly, jogging on the spot. Everybody else, spin on your head. No, I'm only joking. All right, honey, let's change knees up. We'll get the warm up nice and short because we've got a big workout to start with. Boots to glutes change. Big workout to start with, and we'll use it as a bit of our warm up as well. High knees change, knees up. Boots to glutes change, feel up your bum. High knees change. Boots to glutes change. Jogging change, get ready to sprint on the spot as fast as you can in three, two, one, sprint, fast feet. Five, four, three, two, one, jogging change. Get ready to go again in three, two, one, sprint, fast feet. Five, four, Three, two, one, jogging, change. One more time in three, two, one, sprint, fast. Five, four, three, two, one, jogging, change. And say left, touch ground, left hand. When I say right, touch ground, right hand. When I say both, bend down, touch ground, ground with both hands, do a big jump. Left, right, right, both, 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 left, right, both, sprint, fast feet. Both, both, left, right, right, left, both. Sprint, fast feet. High knees, change. Boost the glutes, change. Sprinting on the spot. Go, fast feet. Five, four, three, and rest. One arm high, one low. Slapping at the front of the body, reach my back. Try to get your bicep behind your ear. Full range through your shoulder. Warm the body up. A little bit faster. Pick the pace up for three, two, one. Steady roll on the shoulders forward. Nice big circles. Get the arms up nice and high at the top of the head. Roll the shoulders all the way forward. Nice big circles. A little bit faster. Or three, two, one. Directions change. Roll on them back. Nice big circles. That's it. A little bit faster. Or three, two, one. One, steady pump across the front of the chest, pump across the front of your body. And finish it off for three, two, one, and steady. Now, this first workout might be confusing for some of you. All right, we're gonna do five exercises, okay? One of them, we're gonna do it three times, okay? I'm going to continually keep reminding everybody about what exercises do, so if you get lost, just copy Mel, and if all else fails, punch yourself in the face, okay? First exercise will be a deep squat. Deep squats. All right, we're gonna do stutter push-ups. So bottom half, bottom top, bottom half, bottom top. All right, we're also gonna do uh, burpees. Oh, I'm forgetting myself. Down, out, in, and jump. We're gonna do jumping jacks. And we're gonna do mountain climbers. Okay, so everyone's gonna start with 12 deep squats, then 12 mountain climbers. Then you're going to do 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers. Then 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. So we're going to work on those first three. Deep squats, stutter push-ups, burpees, 12 reps for each. As soon as we finish, we're going to do mountain climbers. We're we'll going to do jumping jacks later. All right, Mel, jump in. 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. All right, mountain climbers, always full number on each leg. All right, get ready to start. 12 deep squats. 
in three, two, one, go. All right, the reason we're doing this type of workout to start with is to get your brain working. Not only your body, but your brain too. 12 deep squats into 12 mountain climbers. Then 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers. Then 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. So you're always finishing with 12 mountain climbers on each leg. Okay, so think of those mountain climbers as like the finisher to each one, and they should all roll from one to the next to the next. So 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, so bottom half, bottom top, bottom half, bottom top, into 12 mountain climbers. So she's got to finish them off. You've got to finish the mountain climbers off after you've finished your stutter push-ups. And then 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. 12 reps this morning because that's how old I am. Right, that's as high as I can count. 12 stutter push-ups into 12 mountain climbers. And then 12 burpees. That is down, kick out, kick in and jump. Down, out, in and jump. 12 burpees. Once you've done your 12 burpees, 12 more mountain climbers. Now we're getting to that point where they're like, what, what are we going to do with those jumping jacks? Once you've finished your burpees and your 12 mountain climbers, you're going to do 50 jumping jacks. 50. Once you finish that 50, you can have a little break before you start the second round. So 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, filthy number, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers, Mel, mountain climbers. Come on, you. You're a bad student. You're a bad one. 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. Once you've finished your mountain climbers, then you have 50 jumping jacks to do. 50 jumping jacks. Come on, as quick as you can. Once you've finished your jumping jacks, then you can have a short rest afterwards of between, you know, 10 seconds, 15 seconds if you need it. Right, let your heart rate come down, a couple of beats, and then start the second round. Second round, no change. Exactly the same. Exactly the same. 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers. 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers. 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. Right, so three fundamental exercises, a deep squat, stutter push-up, and a burpee. After each, you're doing mountain climbers. Good. Have a breather, Mel. Have a breather. She just finished her 50 jumping jacks. All right, you're either still going or you finished well before her. Have a couple breaths. Get your life back together. All right, and then when you're ready, re-engage. 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12. And then 50. All right, one round is all the way through all those exercises. It's a lot of work just to get through one round. All right, your goal is to get through three to five rounds. Three to five rounds. All right, so Mel's easily going to get three out. She'll probably get in the fourth round by the time I call quits. So Mel knows how far she's got to get through this now. 12 deep squats. 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, bottom half, bottom top, then 12 mountain climbers, then 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. Always finishing with 12 mountain climbers. All right, we've just come off a weekend here. I hope you, those that are live, you had a good weekend. Those that are not live, we don't give a shit. We don't care about you. I'm only joking, we don't care. Doing well, Melly. Doing well. Look how dark it is outside. We're just starting to get enough light out there that you couldn't see the reflection of our dirty house. Not that dirty. It's just messy. Messier when the kids get up, though. Think about how much time you would have if they actually cleaned up after themselves. I've heard that it doesn't change even when they get older, so... I can't even hold a candle to that. Just one big phase of mess. 
12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. Mel just finished her 12 burpees. She's doing 12 mountain climbers. And then she's going to go up. And she's going to do 50 jumping jacks to end her second round. End it, Mel. Come on. That's it. Those jumping jacks at the end there, they're not supposed to be physically demanding. But because your body is already taxed from the previous round, your body is tired, those jumping jacks are pretty miserable. Okay? They're not physically exhausting. Low intensity misery. Alright, finish those 50 off. Once Mel finishes the 50, she's finished her second round. We're aiming for three to five rounds. I'm going to let Mel get into about her fourth round before I call it. So some of you will finish less than her. Some of you will get into your fifth and you may even finish your fifth. Alright, we kept the reps at 12. They were going to be 20, but I thought it was a little bit out of control, and then I thought it would do 10, and then 10 just wouldn't be enough. <coughs> it's amazing what two more reps could do. All right, Mel started her third round. 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. Then 50 jumping jacks. All right, be interesting. If I trained at the same time as Mel, it would be so awkward science, it would be ridiculous. God, it would be awkward. Good job, Melly. Your hair's on point this morning. God, look at that plait. I can't even scratch my own ass, let alone plait. Do a plait behind my head. And I was like, you can't even maintain your beard, let alone plait your hair. This is true. This is true. You never know, I might grow my hair out one day, Mel. I'll grow it out. Get a bit of a mullet going. I mean, get one. What's that? What do you mean, get one? What do you mean, get one? I pull it back. <laughs> Can't see it on the video. Alright, go, go, go. Come on, she's just finished her 12 stutter push ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers. This is a rip snorter of a first workout to do. All right, so for those that are doing this live, if you need a short, fast little workout to get cracking, this format, this format is a really good format. You could pretty much pull in, pull an exercise out that you don't like and replace it with something else. You'd actually do a, some form of sit-up instead of a burpee. Right, and this workout would be really balanced for you. So if you only had a small amount of time or if you went away on holiday somewhere and you wanted to get a little workout in, this is what you could be cracking on with. 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12. 12 reps because that's the total age of some of the bloody kids that have just joined us from Instagram. You know who I'm talking about, Wong Wong. 12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers, 50 jumping jacks. This is a workout that you can plug in the back of your diary for later on if you've got a short amount of time. Punch this workout out. If you don't like 12 reps, do 10 for those that can't count. All right, you know who I'm talking to. Blake, you're one of them. Ruben, you're also one too. Ruben's like, what? Yeah, I know. You're pretty good. 50 jumping jacks. You just got to count to 10 and do it five times. There you go. I know there's some of the people in the group that you need to have some sticks in front of you and lay them out to count the tens. If you could, you'd bring your own abacus down. All right, and you can count. I'm talking to Margot Lai here. All right. If she could, she'd have a big wrist strap and have an abacus on her wrist. And like a really big piece of modern technology to count shit with. All right, Melly started her fourth round. Okay, so we're finishing this one up. We're going to finish this workout up. You have less than two minutes. I'm going to give you less than two minutes to get as far through this first warm-up workout. All right, and now I bet you guys are as smart as a bunch of cookies now. All right, your brains are firing, your body's warmed up, you're a little bit stupid at the start, but now you're cock-locked and ready to rock. 
12 deep squats, 12 mountain climbers, 12 stutter push-ups, 12 mountain climbers, 12 burpees, 12 mountain climbers, 50 jumping jacks, you got 90 seconds left, 90 seconds, get as far through it that you can, got a lot of work to get through this morning, it's a cool workout, I say cool, it's not going to be easy, but it's never supposed to be easy, it's only as hard as you make it. I don't have to try and train you through a camera. It's easier when you're training face to face. Face to face is easy. You know when people are dogging it. Face to face, you've just got to hope that people are doing the right thing. Hope that people are pushing hard while they're in lockdown and they don't come out of lockdown and you're a full level of shit. All right, whilst you're in lockdown, this is your time. Look after your body. Get stronger, get faster. Don't use it as a excuse. And if you're in a hotel room and you're in lockdown, what else have you got to do? Just train. Just train. Get in good shape. Right? You'll never get a time like this in your life right, where you don't have to commute. Right? You can get all your work done, your schoolwork done in a short amount of time. All right, you've got more time right now than you ever will. All right, Millie's finishing her mountain climbers. You've got less than one minute left. You've got about 50 seconds, actually. 50 seconds. Come on, Millie, you've got 50 jumping jacks. I reckon Mel will finish her jumping jacks, and then she can go straight into her, first set, her fifth set of squats, and she'll have a couple of seconds. She won't enjoy it. All right, let's finish this rock show off. Finish it off, finish it off. Almost there, 25 seconds left, 25 seconds. 20 seconds. 15 seconds, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, and rest. Good job. Nice little warm up. Mmm. Mm. The lady that has a lot of words. All right. We're going to do two exercises now. Just two. Okay. So just pay attention while you're recovering. First one we're going to do will be a Hindu push up. So start in a push up position. Split your feet. Bum back. Pretend there's a line between your hands. Dive in with your nose, chin, chest. Arms the back. Straighten the arms. Pause. Hips back. We'll show again. Imagine there is a line between your hands and you're going to dive in. Nose, chin, chest, arch the back, straighten the arms, pause, hips back. And if you have to do it on your knees, start on your toes, split your feet, bum back, then go to your knees. Nose, chin, chest, arch the back, straighten the arms, pause, and then hips back. The second exercise we're going to do will be a squat thrust, so a burpee with no jump. So down, kick out, kick in, stand up, and that's it. <coughs> Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to start with Hindu push-ups first. We're going to go... For 25 seconds, and I want you to do as many reps as you can with good form in 25 seconds. Count how many reps you can do in 25 seconds. Okay, mum, come on over. All right, Billy just woke up. He looks happy. You happy, Bill? Good man. Okay, mum, you haven't listened to anything I've said. Can do yeah, you need to get into position though. Yes, thank you. All right. Hindu push-ups, start in push-up position. Split your feet, bums back. Mel, I'm talking to you. Come on, hips back. Hindu push-ups in three, two, one, go. Count your reps. 20 seconds. 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, Six, five seconds, four, three, rest. If you're halfway through a rep, count that one too. Melly, how many reps you do? Six. Mel did six. She did six Hindu push-ups. So this next workout, what she's going to do, she's going to do six Hindu push-ups and six squat thrusts. And she's going to try and do that five times, as fast as she can. You're going to do it five times as fast as she can. She's going to get three or four rounds done before I call it quits. Then so be it. But 
Mel's going to do six Hindu push-ups, whatever number you did for Hindus, that's your number. And you're going to do the exact same number for squat thrust straight afterwards, like a superset. So boom, and then straight into the squat thrust. Once you finish your squat thrust, have a couple breaths, drop straight back down, and then bang, straight back into it. Okay, we're aiming for five rounds through. All right, get ready for Hindus, Mel. Hindu push-ups ready in three, two, one. Hindus, go. All right, finish your reps for Hindu push-ups. Should take you... About 25 seconds for those that cheated, it'll probably take you less than 20 seconds. If you find yourself stopping significantly earlier than when Mel finishes, then you need to add a rep or two because you are that person that is good at pacing themselves when I ask you to go as hard as you can. Hindu push-ups, once you've finished your Hindus, standing straight up, there's no rest between your Hindus and your squat thrusts. You stand straight up and then bang, straight into it. Down, out, in, stand up. Down, out, in, stand up. Down, out, in, stand up. Once you've finished your squat thrusts, lay back down on the ground, have a quick rest, and then start the second round. Hindu push-ups, squat thrusts. All right, Mel's doing sixes. Hopefully there's some of you that are doing a little bit more. I know Evan Gordon's probably doing a couple more. I know Tina's probably doing enough that you can't even count it with an abacus. All right, Hindu push-ups. Now you have a rest between your squat thrusts and your Hindus. You don't rest between the, squat, the, the Hindus and the squat thrusts. You rest after your squat thrusts. So if you need a rest, that is when you rest. Hindu push-ups into squat thrusts. All right, we're getting a couple more people jumping online now. They're starting to wake up. Oh, good morning. Good morning. I hope you had a nice sleep in. Right, the day is ticking away, like sands through the hourglass. This is the days of your lives. Hindu push-up, squat thrust. Go, Mel. Hindus, squat thrusts. Once you finish your squat thrust, give yourself 10, 15 seconds. Have a couple short little breaths. You're aiming for five rounds. You're aiming for five rounds. Big session this morning. Let your heart rate creep up, let it creep up. Heart rate goes up, heart rate goes down. Let's not confuse it. Let's not beat around the bush. There's nothing innovative in the fitness community. There's nothing. What it comes down to is connections. All right? The difference between trainers is connections. That's all it is. God, it's quiet in my house. <laughs> I'm surprised Jules is still asleep. <clears throat> oh, wait, that's right. That's because she gets up about three times through the night. All right, to go and try people's beds. See which one's more comfy. All right, Hindu push-ups, squat thrust. Finish them off, Melly, finish them off. And I was like, why did I do so many Hindus? She hates Hindu push-ups. <laughs> hates them. I thought it was a good time to, to do more of them. Let's see if we can turn them from hatred to that she actually likes them. No, she won't like them. It's only taken us this many live sessions and she still doesn't like them. All right, it's starting to get a little bit more lit outside. A little bit more lit. Good form, Mel, good form. I don't even have to stand in front of you today to cover up your rubbish technique. <laughs> Did you say we could play games? No. Billy, you lied oh, to me. He did lie to you. Okay. Straight in with Melly, don't get distracted. Ah, uh, no. Alright, go up, step forward, see if we It was quiet. Turn the volume down, please. So I don't know who made Billy cry. That was either Mel or myself. We'll just blame me. <laughs> if you made the first kid cry at 6.23 in the morning. Good job, Steve. Well done. You're doing well. <laughs> it's still going. <laughs> He'll get over it. Far out. All right, calm, Mel. Come on, we're losing intensity. Come on. Hindus, squat thrusts. Five rounds through. Five rounds. 
Big pile of misery. Unfortunately, just like poor Bill right now. Poor Billy. Poor bugger. Got such a hard life. <laughs> oh dear. These kids. Carmel, finish off. Is this your third, that's your third round? I can't remember. Yep. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Stay with it. Hindu push ups. Alright, drop straight down, Mel. It's just six. It's just six. Alright, she really hates them. Oh, I can feel it. I can feel her mojo has just dropped. All right. She's not happy. She's not even engaging with me. When I look back at her, she just looks straight through me. All right. She's like freaking superwoman. She's going to cut me in half with laser beams. I hate Hindus. Hindus are good. They hit your peck on three different angles. Right, three different angles. As you're lowering in, it hits that kind of upper peck, and mid peck, right at the bottom phase, and then when you arch your back and push away at the end, that hits the lower peck. The peck's just one muscle. It's not beat around the bush. It just hits it on three different angles, though. Go, Mel. Come on, finish it off. All right, team, you have 90 seconds left. 90 seconds left. Just enough time for Mel to get this round done. And then crack on as much as you can in the next round. Right, let's finish this off. Finish it off. Time is ticking away. Time is not our friend this morning. All right, I've got so much work for us to do. And so little time. So little time. All right, finish strong. Finish strong. All right, one minute left. Less than a minute, Mel. See how far you get through this fifth and final round for you. See how far you can get through it. Keep cracking, keep cracking, guys. Come on, stay with it. Hindus and squat thrusts. Two miserably crap combination exercises. All right, dive on in. Come on down to Big Splash, the place you want to be. For fun and excitement for all the family. Not at the moment. Stay with it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Billy sounds like he's over it now. Sounds like a typical four-year-old. Meltdown on live camera. If only we could we'll save this video and show him when he's 21. And say, listen, this is what you sound like. 20 seconds, let's go, come on. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, Five seconds, four, come on, three. Rest, have a little breather. All right, Melly got her fifth round done. God, we timed that well, didn't we, Mel? Okay, next one. Give your legs a little bit of a breather. We're gonna do, we're gonna do super sit-ups. We're gonna do toe taps. So legs up, roll the shoulder off the ground, doing a crunch. And the last one will be tantrums, opposite hand, opposite leg. Full number on each side. We're gonna start with super sit-ups first. So, everybody, park your butts. Melly, stop sitting on the lounge. All right, it's not the weekend. You're not sitting up watching Project Runway or whatever you else shit you're watching. All right, park your butt. Lay down. Okay, super sit-ups. You're gonna do as many super sit-ups as you can in 20 seconds. Count how many reps you can do. This will be your working set for those that like to go slow now and set a really low number. There is a reason why instructions are in fluorescent freaking writing and shit for people like you. All right? Safety briefs were written for people like you. Move fast as, as fast as you can for 20 seconds. Count your reps. Three, two, one, go. Count your reps. 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six. Five seconds, four, come on, three. Rest. How many reps you do, Melly? Thirteen. Thirteen. What a lucky number. Okay, Mel's doing thirteen. Same format as we did last time. She's gonna do thirteen super sit-ups, thirteen toe taps, and then thirteen tantrums 
on each arm. Once she's done, she's gonna roll back over, have a quick breath, and then do it again. Goal is five rounds. All right, get ready to start, Mel. Everyone else, get ready to go. Super sit-ups for your reps into toe taps into tantrums. Three, two, one, go. Super sit-ups for your reps, into toe taps for your reps, into tantrums for your reps. Try not to rest between the toe taps and the tantrums. Rest after the tantrums. Your rest is after the tantrums. All right, so it needs to be a seamless rollover. All right, less than a second. The workout is not going to stop for you. You can have a rest after you've finished your tantrums. After you've finished your tantrums, then you can have a short rest. But until then, it's game on, mole. As hard as you can. All right, so Melly's doing 13 super sit-ups, 13 toe taps, 13 tantrums. She's just finished her first round. She's rolled over. She's having a quick breather. And now she's going to go again. All right, five rounds through as fast as you can. Five rounds as fast as you can. If you only get three done, that's still impressive. That's still way more than the shit bags that are still laying in their fart sacks, contemplating waking up for the day and how they should do it. All right, don't be a horse's ass, team. All right, life will tick you by. All right, you need to train your body. Train your body so it can move around. Right, and then people's bad shit just bounces off you because you're too tired to fight back. Quick roll over, Mel. Quick, quick, quick. Come on. <coughs> you're lucky these tantrums aren't a million reps. You're lucky. Five rounds as fast as you can. Right, the reps are short because you can just suffer through them. That's the point. Right, the point is that you can just suffer through it. Now we're in that final big push towards the end of the session. Final big push. I feel like we've done a lot this morning. There's lots and lots of movement had. All right, give our legs a bit of a breather. Give our arms a bit of a breather. Let's hit that trunk. Make sure you breathe out. When you raise up in any of your sit-ups or toe taps, breathe out on the way up. Breathe out. Last thing you want to do is have too much air in your lungs and you've got these two big pillows in your chest and you're trying to condense them. It doesn't work. All right, that shit don't fly. All right, Melly's finishing her 13 tantrums. She's so good at them too. See where Julesy's learnt them from. Must be genetic. All right, that's what your mum looks like when she's having a tantrum too. No, she doesn't. Must be my family. All right, come on, super sit-ups. Mel's in her third round now, third round. Super sit-ups, toe taps, tantrums. Four. Okay, fourth round, whatever. God, man, that didn't warrant having a rest halfway through. All right, Mel's in her fourth round, my apologies. I right, get attacked online afterwards in the comments section. Steve, you can't count. Well, I'm not here to count reps. It sets. I'm here to watch a clock. Well, that makes small talk. Go, 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 go. Come on. Finish that fourth set, Mel. Wherever you're up to, it doesn't matter. Just work hard, work hard. Come on, make it worth your time. All right, this is your time to yourself to exercise. All right, then make it worth it. Okay, the good thing about this type of training is you don't have distractions like other social media popping up, all right, trying to take your attention away. All right, just lay on the ground now and work your body. Work your body. Fifth round. All right, I'm going to give you 45 seconds left. 45 seconds. All right, get as far through it that you can. All right, those that are almost into the fifth round, good. Punch it out. If you're in the third round, you're doing well. Mel's about to finish her fifth round. You've done okay, Mel. All right, let's finish strong. Finish strong. Last little bit. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. How are you going to spend it? Spend it being fast. Spend it being badass. Go, go, go. 15. 
14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds, 4, 3, push, and rest. Melly, you started one rep of her six. Okay, Mel, you don't really have to move. I'll work around you. Okay, while you're laying there, some of you need to start standing up because we're going to hit our legs to finish this session. Okay, we're going to make our legs feel like they're going to fall off. So, the four exercises. We're going to do four this time. Four, because it'll make time go very quick. First one we're going to do will be mothers or pike squats. So, feet together, grab your toes all the way down, all the way up. We're going to do pike squats. We're going to do frogs, so weight through the arms, kick out into a push-up position, kick back in, kick out, kick back in. We're going to do Navy Seal star jumps, so feet together, hands in line with the shins, big jump, land straight back down into it. Make sure you bend at the knee, don't bend at the waist. So essentially you're just dropping down into this position, doing a big jump and then landing straight back down. And then the last one will be a pump squat, a pump squat. And this one is going to be like pushing shit uphill. So Melly, move into position. We're going to do pike squats or mothers to start with. We're going for 12 seconds. That can only mean one thing. It's going to hurt. 12 seconds. You're going to do as many pike squats that you can in 12 seconds. Make sure you go hard. Don't be weak. Get ready to start. Mel, feet together. Grab your toes. Three, two, one, go. 12 seconds. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Rest. How many reps you do, Melly? Twelve. Twelve. Should have done thirteen. Okay, Mel's doing twelve pike squats, twelve frogs, twelve Navy Seal star jumps, twelve pump squats. Then she's gonna have a quick rest, and then she's gonna do it again. Her goal is as many rounds as she can in the last couple of minutes. Okay, get ready to start. Feet together. Grab your toes. In three, two. One, out. Let's go, last little bit. 12 seconds, pike squats, into frogs. Frogs is probably gonna take the longest. It's probably gonna be one of the hardest. Then rolling from pike squats into frogs is a miserable. And then frogs into Navy Seal star jumps, also. Quite miserable, but you can do Navy Seal star jumps quite quick. All right, see if you can transition from Navy Seal star jumps, all right, into those pump squats. Pump squats as fast as you can. All right, Mel is just finishing her Navy Seals. Pump squats is the fourth and final exercise. So bottom half, bottom half, bottom half, bottom half. Mel's doing 12, 12 pike squats, 12 frogs, 12 Navy Seals. 12 pump. Oh. She's going to have a quick rest. Yes, good. Her legs are sore. It's just like climbing a really big freaking mountain. A really big freaking mountain. That is our life together. All right, don't rest too long, Mel. All right, back into it again. 12, 12, 12, 12 for Mel. Hope your reps are a little bit higher or a little bit lower. Pike squats, frogs. Navy Seal star jumps, star jumps, and pump squats. All right, you have three minutes left of your workout. Three minutes. All right, and then the session's over. Three minutes. All right, we've had a very, very big workout this morning. We've had lots and lots of movement, lots of exercises, lots of reps, lots to keep you busy. We've stayed fairly consistent with our viewers this morning. What's good, that says to me that people are actually training and not just watching from their beds going no i do not want to do that workout or they'll just lie to themselves and go oh yeah 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 i'll do this workout later no you won't no you won't you won't do it later right? if you're watching it and not doing it there's absolutely no freaking way in hell that you're going to do the workout later all right, because you can see right now that Mel's legs feel like they're going to fall off. And I feel like I'm going to get the machete out in the back room there. We can cut her legs off to ease the tension. It is outstanding, Mel, so freaking outstanding. All right, if you're watching it and not doing this workout, there's no way that you will do this workout and you have already failed for the day. Don't fail. 
win the day. Come on. One second at a time. Even if you do this workout for 10 minutes, do the first 10 minutes. Do the back 10 minutes. Either way, just do something. All right, Melly's in her third round. Big pile of misery. She's chasing, chasing a big angry ghost of herself. In the reflection, she's got out one of our dogs licking the window. Oh, she's so excited to see Mel. So excited. I bet she's got lots of shit outside for Mel to have to go and pick up too. All right, just in time for people to step in. Go, Mel. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Navy Seals, come on, get them done. Oh, dear. I wish I could create more time, but I don't have much of it left. We have 90 seconds left. 90 seconds. How will you spend that 90 seconds? Will you spend it standing around, looking at your reflection in the window, contemplating what we're going to have for breakfast? Or will you move your butt? Move your butt. We're finishing with legs because it'll have the biggest effect later. You'll sit down afterwards and you'll be like, good, I'm happy I can sit down. Last little bit. All right, fourth round, Melly, come on. Punch it, punch it, punch it. I reckon we've got enough time for you to finish the whole round, Mel. Sub a minute left. One minute left. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. You're racing, Mel. You're racing her. Come on. She's trying to finish in under the minute. She's trying to finish it. I have a feeling she's going to get close. 40 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Last bit, last bit. Make it worth your time and your effort this morning. If you're doing this workout, right, you are a beast. You are a weapon. All right, maintain the intensity. Maintain the ferocity. Piss awesomeness. Come on. Sweat excellence. Inspire the people around you. 19, 18, come on, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds. Go, Mel. Come on. 9, 8, 7. Come on. 6, 5 seconds. Finish it, Mel. 4. And rest. Take a knee. Take a knee. We'll do a very quick stretch. If you jump out at this stage, you better be rolling into more training. Awesome yoga. All right, drop down to one knee. This is the least amount of stretching you can do for your body. All right, to ease the injury. All right, big pace forward, square your hips, push forward, push forward. Unlock the back hip, raise the arm up and back, look up to the sky, breathe out, increase the stretch through your hip. Hold that stretch for five, four, three, two, one. Release toe pointing up, put a slight bend in your knee. Leaning forward slightly, feel that stretch up your hamstring. Breathe out, increase the stretch. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Release, trenching legs. Nice, big pace forward. Square your hips. Push forward, push forward. Unlock the back hip. Raise the arm up and back. Look up to the sky. Breathe out, increase the stretch through your hip. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Release, toe pointing up, slight bend in the knee, leaning forward slightly. Feel that stretch up your hamstring. Breathe out, increase it just a little bit. Hold for three, two, one. Release, standing up, feet and knees together, forearms under the back of the knees. Hug your legs, try and stand up, feel the stretch over your shoulder blades. Hold that stretch for three, two, one. Release, Morning. reaching up to the sky. Fashion. What do you say, Julesy? Morning. Morning, fashion. Morning. All right, let's see your socks. All right, stand next to mum. All right, one more time, back down again. Yep, we love them, Jules. Good job. Try and stand up. Feel a stretch over your shoulders for three, two, one. Release, reaching up to the sky. Big stretch. Arch your back slightly. Right arm down your spine. Pull it down on the elbow. Keep the weight off your neck. Hold that stretch for three, two, one. Release. <laughs> Changing arms. Pulling down on the elbow. Pulling down on the elbow. Hold the stretch for three, two, one. One, release, find a door arch or a human being that's a little bit softer than you. Lean away from them, feel it across your pack. Make sure you do both sides. You've done amazing today, great job. Very tough workout. All right, send it, don't send this to people that you enjoy because they won't enjoy you all right, and they won't enjoy us. Okay, so be selective in who you let do this workout. Have a wonderful day. What do you got to say, Mel?
Good job. You look like you just stepped we out did of the it. shower. Oh, sweaty. I'm always sweaty. Yep. Well done. Enjoy your public holiday Monday. If you're just tuning in, get it done. Get it done. Stay strong. See you guys.